That was a tremendous goal. Look at that. Oh, goodness. Really? But that goes straight and hard. Another six. Look at that. Effortless. Straight. And the cameraman on top of the second tier was in a bit of trouble. Another one, a double dose of it. Another good blow. Really struck it well again, Nicholas Poran. Make that eight scoring shot, eight boundaries. A massive hit. This one just pitched up. Just in the arc. Never know his goals with it. Six more runs. This is very favorable to Chris Gale. Very, very favorable. And he's delighting in it. 60 for one. In this final T20I, Chris Gale making his present felt out in the middle. Uses his feet to good effect. Andre Fletcher finally releases the shackles. And he gets a maximum. He must know that he needs to change up at some point. The other thing is, Andre Fletcher has to know if, he, if he's not dismissed, don't let it be dot balls before and dot balls after a boundary. And again, this time three offside, does it go all the way? Yes, it does. That was a tremendous blow, look at that. Wow, just wow. From Evan Lewis, goes downtown and gets the maximum. Those two were wide ones. This one just getting a bit closer, but again, that line. Just enough for Evan Lewis to free up his arm. Oh, goodness. Really? That is dynamic, powerful. This one was just smacked. 97 meters out of the ground. Stylish finish. That's synonymous with the man, Andre Russell. Always attractive, always flamboyant in the way he plays and he finishes the innings in style for the West Indies. Trying it again, and it'll be two and two. 12 runs in those two balls changes us over completely. The final stage, the last match of the series, series on the line, everything on the line. Goes for it. That's his bread and butter shot, Chimran Hetmeyer. How often have we seen this? Enough time just to rock on that back foot and just hammer that for half a dozen. Right out of the middle. Locking the hit straight up in the air. Not even considering anything inside the playing arena. Oh, that's right out of the screws. That has gone right up on the almost top shelf. 50 runs to Kyron Pollard. This is a really, really important innings. Yeah, he know he needs to bat long Kyron Pollard. He's talked about a lot about cricket smarts and what is required. This one hit for 92 meters, bringing up his 50. Oh, he's hammered that for six. That is a very good shot. Back to his standard pace, that delivery, and that smacked. Opens the front foot and aims over that uh, long on region. Oh, that's wonderful. 
really brilliant hitting and it was needed by Puran who's been taking his time. More power and more distance. Two sixes in a row. Really tremendous blow from Andrew Russell. Two consecutive sixes to start the 17th over. Driving straight down the ground. What a shot from Fabian Allen. Just his fourth delivery he's faced. Such a talented cricketer. Picked that slow ball quite early. Good blue. Oh, that sounded good. Good enough for a massive six onto the second tier. 150 on the board and in the 15th over. Pitched up delivery and it was smashed by Andrew Russell, who just stood there and going even further than the 90 meter six that he hit earlier. 95 meters. Welcome to the crease. I think that's what Chris Bell said. Welcome to the crease, Reza. There is a reason why he's never bowled into 20s, clearly, Mike. But what a welcome. There's no doubt about that. You can argue with the wind and all of those things. Good strike. Big shot from Darren Bravo. He gets the connection this time. The massive blow here at the Sir Richard Stadium. His first six of the match. It's high, it's gone. And Fabian Allen, this is your night here at Coolidge. The West Indies have walked the tough road. Brilliant young man. He gets it. He gets all of it. Hasaranga wrapped that up in a bow tie and presented Jason Holder with the no ball. That's gone, that's what Simmons wanted. He finally unleashes and unfurls a mighty six.